Yeah. Yeah. So, I mean, this kind of gets into a spiritual aspect of everything, but I really, 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 truly believe that when you take the time to figure out what is in your soul and you attach to that like your life depends on it, everything in your life will line up. Everything will work itself out and it will feel like magic. Like I'm literally getting chills right now, Willard, because I experienced magic so much in my life because I'm answering this calling. Even this moment right now, I'm not nervous. I knew at some point I was gonna be telling my story and it was gonna reach multiple people. There are so many people who are trying to find themselves, trying to determine whether they think they're worthy to go into entrepreneurship, whether their idea is good enough. Um, but I just charge people to just continue to get to know themselves and what is your path, your calling, it will be revealed to you. And once you see it, you cannot pretend like you don't know. You cannot do that. If you grab hold of that thing and you just walk forward, it will work itself out. And you, don't, you won't know how, you won't know when, where, but it will work itself out. So like, that's just, that's just how I feel about it. I have been trying to figure out how do I create the experiences that boost the character and confidence of other people. I grew up playing sports and I think that very early on I understood the power of coaching and how motivating a person to just simply start or to take a leap, how far that goes. Um, not only is learning leaps uh, speaking to the progress that a person makes in their learning journey, but it just speaks to my personal journey in leaping into entrepreneurship. So I just really see all of this is an opportunity to build the mental resilience because you're going to need it. Every step of the way, you're going to be tested, challenged. Two. So what is two times four? Two, four, six, eight, bam. That's what I'm writing. Two, down. four, six, eight. Figured out a way to extract that sports component um, without it having to be an organized sport because everybody doesn't have access to that.